lot of people I was thinking don't want to go to the gym. So a lot of people like going to the gym is something that they may dread. So I also feel like if you can make it a really comfortable environment somewhere that is not really intimidating. <laughs> Somewhere they feel that they can just hang out and chill, they might be more inclined to come in and get fitter. Belt Town Difference is just uh, little tiny things you can do to just go above and beyond the normal standard. 99 people out of 100 would just put up a whatever panel. Just striving for excellence wherever we can, whether it be a small little bow and a yarn when we tie our t shirts. It's the wood matches on the it's light switch for God's sake. It's the match. <laughs> or wax stamps on graduation packets. Just any little thing goes a long way. This was found actually in a dumpster. The lockers we had custom designed, so we took it and repurposed it. This is a custom order, so we uh, wanted them to match the rest of the gym. Somebody that uh, was walking by and saw we had some chandeliers like that and the brown wood, and she looked in and thought it was a wine bar opening. <laughs> Unfortunately, Dynamax doesn't even make this anymore, so we can't custom order any more med balls. So everybody has these, I'm willing to buy some more from you. <laughs> so she came in and then she found out we were a gym and she actually joined. She stayed with us for a couple years and now she moved to Miami and she's still doing CrossFit. This is our lounge. You can just hang out here, kick your feet up post-workout or pre-workout again, cheer people on, play darts, which is uh, one of my favorite activities. Deciding on the lighting was one of the things that took the most time. Just chill, make yourself a drink. Got a little collection of whiskey over here. And just seriously, like combing through uh, different catalogs and looking online for lights. Probably 12 hours, just for these lights right here. Yes, so we've had clients that uh, maybe think we're a little bit obsessive compulsive, if you will. This chair shouldn't be here. What did you do? It's here. It belongs right here. <laughs> God damn it, Pat. Can you not not like go so close to my face? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> this is another thing that really bothers me too is when the med balls don't face out. <laughs> is that OCD? <laughs> but then they'll go maybe to another gym and realize that uh, they're really actually happy that we take pride and care in the gym. Not that other people don't, but just to maybe a different level. I mean, if you're gonna be somewhere and spend all your time somewhere, I just want it to feel really homey and comfortable. This piece right here is from our very first CrossFit gym, the first day we opened. We had no equipment, we had one barbell. These are the four people that showed up. So this started at our first gym. We thought it'd be cool to just see where visitors were coming from. I had no idea opening a CrossFit gym if people would drop in a lot, if they wouldn't. So put up some paper and hope that people would just leave a little note and hey, I'm from here and this is the date I visited. There were their numbers, we didn't have a whiteboard. We just wrote it on a piece of paper. It was such an honor. We had Greg Glassman come by the gym for an event and he took the time to leave us a little message on the board here kind of burned the edges and made it look old, put it on this piece of wood, which I believe is actually one of our old lifting platforms. Something I look at actually every day, I think it's really, it's really special. Don't need to have a cool looking gym. Obviously what keeps clients around is people are coming back for your quality of coaching, your programming, are you getting them fitter at the end of the day? So again, we're always trying to figure out how we can improve, what can we do better, how can I make the system better, how can I program something a little bit better, how can I develop the coaches, how can we you know, just make the experience here for every member better than anything else. And all of this stuff is just a bonus, right? You get to work out, hopefully get a good workout, get coached, and then have a glass of whiskey up in the lounge. <laughs>